assalamu alaikum friends my name is muhammad yunus and i am odo technical developer in today's video we are going to talk about how to install uh, two python versions uh, on the same ubuntu machine uh, for example we have uh, ubuntu 20.04 and we have already installed some uh, odo previous versions like 16 14 or uh, 15 so it is a chance that uh, we have already installed or we are already using uh, python 3.8 or 3.6 uh, and now if you want to install uh, udo 17 so uh, like the minimum requirement for udo 17 is uh, python 3.10 so in that case uh, we need uh, two different uh, versions of python uh, to be installed on our ubuntu machine so in today's video i am just going to talk about how you can install it uh, so first step is to update uh, sudo apt update update your system and uh, the purpose of this step is to ensure uh, that your packages lists um, are updated to the latest versions and that your system have the latest security patches and the second command for update is to uh, sudo apt upgrade okay so everything is upgraded so uh, there is something that needs to be removed so we can just uh, run this command uh, to remove it okay and yes okay so it will just take a bit of time to uh, remove this so it is done so the next step is to uh, install the prerequisite the prerequisite package which is uh, needed for uh, in managing of two different uh, version of python is software property common uh, this package is uh, like necessary for the infra infrastructure of managing uh, different uh, software repositories so uh, let me just uh, add this command sudo apt install software properties uh, common okay software properties common okay sorry we made a mistake like this so we need to uh, use this so uh, it is already installed uh, and uh, the next thing is you, we need to add a uh, dead check uh, ppa personal package archive for python uh, this adds uh, the dead check uh, ppa to your system the dead check uh, ppa contains various versions of python including newer versions uh, like newer ones not available in the default Ubuntu repository. So, for this purpose, we need to uh, install this. Uh, so, do uh, add apt uh, repository. We need to add this uh, repository like this ppa and then dead shakes, uh, snakes, ppa. Okay so hit enter to uh, install it and then uh, press enter or uh, cancel to editing it we need to edit okay so it will be added and uh, so once it's, it's done we need to move to the next step so the next step is to uh, update the list again uh, which is uh, this command sudo apt update so the this update uh, the packages list uh, again to include uh, the packages from this uh, dead snakes ppa so uh, it has been updated and then uh, we can install python uh, 3.10 so the command that we need to use is sudo apt install python uh, sorry python 3.10 okay so hit enter and uh, the install will uh, get started so it will st uh, start downloading python 3.10 and we'll start uh, installing it it will just take a few uh, seconds and after that uh, we need to install pip also for uh, uh, python 3.0 so the purpose of installing pip is uh, like uh, this is a package manager to install uh, python packages so uh, let me check python version 3.0 one zero uh, version like this so it is uh, 3.10.13 so it is the uh, latest version and in order to install uh, pip we need to first install uh, python 3.10 data uh, utils which is um, the prerequisite for uh, pip 
so uh, let me just install it apt install python 3.10 uh, dist utils and yes so this will install this uh, package for us and then we need to download uh, the pip package so which is uh, let me just copy the link from here so here is the link so you can just type the link from uh, this pip.py okay so it will start downloading pip okay so let me run a command so here you can see the pip uh, has been in, uh, downloaded so we need to run a command python 3.10 so like we want to install it as a python uh, 3.10 and then uh, add the file name get pip.py okay so this will uh, help us to install pip for us and then using the pip we can install python 3.10 packages and let me just verify if pip is installed successfully python 3.10 uh, dash m pip and then double dash version okay so uh, pip is installed uh, now if i want to check uh, the python 3 version this version so it will say like 3.8 so anything if i want to uh, like create a virtual environment with python 3.8 i will have to use python 3 and in case if i want to create it as a 3.10 so i can use this python 3.10 so uh, this is how you can uh, use a different python version on the same uh, ubuntu machine okay so the installation is done and uh, thank you for watching this video if you enjoyed it uh, please uh, hit the like button and also uh, don't forget to share with your uh, friends thank you